Hey friends, it's John, your carnivore teacher, and today we're going to talk about sugar. Not just the sweet white powder we know is in our cookies and soda, but what it's actually doing inside of our body. If you've ever had sticky fingers after eating something sugary, congrats. You've already experienced what sugar does on the outside of your body. Now, let's talk about what happens on the inside. Sugar is sticky. Literally, when you spill sugar or syrup on your counter, it sticks. Your hands get tacky. The residue clings to everything and water alone doesn't get it off. You need heat and soap and scrubbing. Now, imagine that same sugar coursing through your bloodstream. That's exactly what happens when you eat sugar. Whether it comes from your table or juice or bread or pasta, it all breaks down into glucose. And that glucose, it's sticky. Let's talk about glycation. What is that? I'm going to break it down for you. Glycation is a chemical reaction where sugar molecules bind to proteins and fat in your body without enzymes. It's uncontrolled, non-reversible, and damaging. Your body's proteins like collagen and elastin and, and hemoglobin aren't meant to be caramelized. But sugar doesn't care. It sticks to them. And over time, this sugar gluing creates harmful compounds called advanced glycation end products or AGEs. Yes, AGEs, fitting name, right? Age, because they literally age you faster from the inside out. What do AGEs do? These advanced glycation end products cause cellular damage, chronic inflammation, and oxidative stress. Here's how they wreck your system. Number one, they damage your blood vessels. Glycation makes your blood vessels stiff and brittle. That's bad news for your heart, your kidneys, your brain, and everything in between. This is a major player in atherosclerosis that's hardening of your arteries, not cholesterol, sugar. Wrinkles and aging skin. Collagen and elastin are your skin's scaffolding. When they get glycated, they break down. You lose elasticity, hydration, and firmness. That's how sugar ages your face, sags your skin, crow's feet, wrinkles. It's not just sun or smoking, it's sugar. Brain fog and neurodegeneration. AGEs mess with your brain too. They are implicated in Alzheimer's, often called type 3 diabetes by some researchers because of how sugar damages neurons. Number four, vision problems. Glycation stiffens the lens of our eye and the tiny capillaries that feed your retina. That's why diabetics often go blind because sugar is wrecking delicate tissues. Number five, joint stiffness and pain. Cartilage proteins get glycated, leading to stiffness, inflammation, and accelerated joint breakdown, aka arthritis. But I don't eat dessert. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Bread, glycates. Pasta, glycates. Fruit, smoothies, big time, glycate. If it spikes your blood sugar, it fuels this process. Even if you're not diabetic, the glycation train is happening every time your blood sugar is elevated. So you might ask, how do I avoid glycation? The answer is simple. Stop fueling it. You want to reduce glycation? You've got to stop spiking your blood sugar. That means cutting sugar. Grains, refined carbs, seed oils, because they accelerate oxidative stress on top of glycation. What do I eat? Meat, fish, eggs, butter, real food. The carnivore diet isn't just anti-inflammatory, it's anti-glycation. It keeps blood sugar low and stable, reducing the sticky mess that leads to disease. So your body isn't broken, it's just glued together wrong. Glycation is like caramelizing the inside of your body, except it's not delicious, it's destructive. And once proteins and fats are glycated, they're done. Your body can't fix it. It just has to break them down and rebuild, which takes energy and time. And the older you are, the harder that becomes. That's why prevention is everything. Here are my closing thoughts. 
Next time you feel tempted by a cinnamon roll or even a healthy granola bar, remember, sugar is sticky. It sticks to your fingers. It sticks to your insides. And worst of all, it sticks to your future. Stop feeding the flame of inflammation and glycation. Eat clean, eat smart, eat meat, live longer, live better, and stay sharp. Be a carnivore. If you like this message about glycation, click the thumbs up. Send this by sharing it to a friend or family member and leave a comment or ask a question and I will get back to you. Have a great day.